Well, take your pick in this one. Be a tough call up in Vegas, but you got the machine, Miles Farhan, off the big race over there in Dallas in the 981. Jagger Jones in the 98, and those two have been battling all afternoon. Should be a good one here. Row number two, Colin Queen in the 111. Dakota Tate in the 14. Flying Ryan Charteau in cart number seven, 54. Daniel in Zunza, the Dominator, Dominic Flash Gordon. In cart number 52 in the 198 at Jace Jones. Jalen Mack, Little Mack out of Mack Motorsports in the 141.05. CK5, you heard him on the interview earlier. Terminator Tanner Hudspeth out of Huddy Motorsports. K&N Casey Gillis in the 1. Ethan Ho in the 168. 20 Max Saga. Bentley Adams is 79. 78. Geneva Keller. 34. George D. Marcus Rodriguez in the 09. 26. Ryan McElwee. Tyler Shapatha in the 21. And they're bringing them around one more time. Yeah, they got a little too jumpy on that one. Frankie Mossman's in the three. Isaac Gutierrez in the 46. Nathan Gutierrez in the 17. Alexander D in the cart number 12. And Shea Weston in cart number 70 in the back of the pack. So Farhan and Jagger Jones up on the front row. And watch out for the machine in the 981. As we previously mentioned, Shabby, essentially we're seeing the top two drivers in the nation within this particular class here. What an accomplishment for Farhan pulling off the big victory in Dallas. Looks like they're all back in their places, so we should get hopefully a green here. Side by side, slowed down and grid him up. This is about the slowest you'll see these guys going since the driver's meeting this morning. So attempt number two at the green. Looks a little better. Racing. And a full field of junior ones. Trouble for the 79 of Bentley Adams. Onto the infield through corner curve and back on track. Yeah, we had a few scatter off course there just for a second. As the field spreads out into several different groups on lap number one. Well, we got a lead change already as they go through carousel. Three of them out front trying to distance themselves early from the rest of the field. As they go into Long Beach for the first time in a 14 lap main. Junior one, Comer and the Pilots. One lap in the books. Change for a second now. Oh, you think they mean business out there? Check out Colin Queen in the 111. With the machine right on his back number plate, Colin Queen in the silver helmet. I it, think the machine wants to, to be in first place real quick here. Yeah, Queen has been quick all day, also representing heading over there to the big race in Texas. Uh, LAKC regular Colin Queen running a good one out front. Farhan really putting the pressure on outside, headed into Horseshoe. Going side by side, but decides to back off just momentarily. Yeah, definitely coming up to that left-hander. Farhan will not have the advantage on the leader being stuck on the outside, so he tucked back in behind Queen. And they are bumper to bumper over the stripe. Farhan may be looking for a pass here. 98 is right there. That's Jagger Jones. He's been running with the quick carts in this class all afternoon long. But yeah, now Betty. Jones is le losing a little bit of uh, ground on the leaders as those first two trying to pull away now. Yeah, those front two have really hooked up, leaving Jones just a little bit further behind there in third place. Colin Queen and Miles Farhan.
into Long Beach early on in a 14 lap main for the junior one combers and the pilots. Colin continues out front holding off the charge from Farhan in the 981, Jones in the 98, and then a gap back to fourth with Chase Jones in the 198 holding off in Zunza in the 54, but they are far back now in the first three. Yeah, there's some pretty good battles right behind our front three runners here. As these guys are running some low 53 second lap times in the pre-mains. With PRD Senior up next, we need PRD Senior up to the grid. Apologies to those of you watching live stream. I guess we had another little outage there momentarily, so it looks like we're back up and live again. Three of them okay, but out at the entrance of the horseshoe. Looks like they got them off onto the infield on the other side of the barriers. But their day will end early. We'll get you some cart numbers just as soon as we have them reported in happening down there at the other end of the racetrack. So for those of you watching live stream, we just maybe lost a little bit of a lap there with our connection being lost, but we're still right in the middle of our Junior One Comer main event. If anything, all you did was miss Colin Queen running strong out there on the lead, and he has opened up a little bit of breathing room on the machine. Colin Queen in the 111 leads far hand through the carousel. Farhan not going away. Farther back to Jones. With the PRD seniors to follow. PRD seniors up to the starting grid. 25 of them in a full field. Here for the Junior One Comers, Junior One Pilots. Now front, two, front two runners coming up on some lap traffic. Yeah, good job by the lap traffic staying out wide through corner curver, and the first two get by clean, and it does not affect the running order, although Farhan now. Definitely helped Farhan on that one. It, it helped that first two bunch up even, even closer. Yeah, he is right back up on the back number plate of Colin Queen in the 111. Farhan again putting the pressure on. We're halfway through this main. Yeah, Colin Queen is halfway home, but Farhan is really applying the heavy pressure now. And Farhan wants by. Queen's going to be tough to get around in that 111 machine. Heading through carousel, there's still nose to tail. Yeah, Farhan might be just where he wants to be right now. As you see, he's had some leads in the past out here. Only to have somebody just pull that inside dive bomb move into Long Beach. So maybe Farhan saying, hey, maybe this time I'll sit in second and see what I can do rather than lead. 
Yeah, it's kind of benefit to these, these two front runners because they have really distanced themselves now from Jones in third place. Yeah, smart move maybe just to work together and just keep using that momentum and pull away from the rest of the field. Yeah, these guys are very comfortably in front of that third place runner of Jones. Looking forward to the PRD Senior Race coming up next for all you PRD Senior fans watching on Kart Racer TV on the live stream broadcast. PRD Senior up next, followed by Kid Karts and PRD Pilots. Those will be our next three races on the day. Don't go anywhere, Kart Racer TV fans. We've got plenty of live LAKC racing the rest of the afternoon for you to finish off your weekend. Chappie and JR calling all the action. JR doing double duty with the microphone and the camera in hand. Yeah, you can see Forehand continuously pushing now. It doesn't look like he wants to pass as of yet, but he's just kind of sizing things up now. Looks like they will have some lap traffic to contend with though here, Chappie. Yeah, and we'll see if that has an outcome on the finish. These guys are really pushing hard. Got a lapper coming up right in front of our front two runners now. All right, they get by clean on the straightaway. That couldn't have happened in a better position on the racetrack. They still got some more to contend with though as they come through corner curva. And they're staring down two more now and they'll probably catch them on this next lap. So Farhan right there behind Colin Queen. Now they've caught those two lappers as they go through the carousel. Let's see what happens here now. Yeah, it looks like somebody lost power, not with the leaders that slower traffic out there at Horseshoe. He's just inside of the tire barrier and off the racing line. So a smart move to get off the racetrack. Boy, great move by our, our front two runners to get by those lappers. So they've disposed of those racers. I don't know if they're gonna catch this other group that's in front of them. Laps are winding down now in this main event. An incredible job of driving up front by the 111 of Colin Queen, Junior One Comer. We've got our Junior One pilots out there as well. How about the 05? You heard him on the interview earlier. He's a lot louder behind the steering wheel than he is on the interviews. Give it up for CK5. Now forehand to the inside at Long Beach. Let's see if he can make this one stick. Two laps remaining. No, Queen comes right back. Side by side. Farhand to the inside, makes the move, now has the lead. Let's see if Queen comes right back. Protects the inside, the crowd's going crazy on this one. Queen once again making a move. Oh, both these young guns want this one. No one's going to give an inch. Now lap traffic might make a difference again here, Chappie. Yeah, they're coming up to about five slower drivers here. This is no doubt going to have bearing on the outcome of this race. Oh, yeah, that group is really going to be a potentially uh, situation for these. Oh, they're just hitting a wall of drivers here. At least they're going to meet up with them on the straightaway. The leader is going to go down on the inside. One remaining. Farhand going outside. Looks like Colin goes inside. Nice, great move by both these racers. Still got two more to contend with. On the white flag lap. This might help Queen just a bit. Tim Wyatt, we need your transponder. Colton Griffin, go collect your trophy. Tim Wyatt, we need your transponder. Colton Griffin, collect your trophy. So the leaders have split those lapped uh, runners there. Queen looking to the ends, to the outside now. Wow. 
One corner remaining. Queen to the inside. Farhan gets hung out outside. Is it gonna happen again? Are you kidding me, Colin? Queen. Nice move by Queen to take the win. What a finish. Give it up for those two young guns out there. Farhan ends up in second. And Farhan's got to be saying, what do I have to do to hold on to a lead through Long Beach? What a move by Colin Queen. Just diving down to the inside and had enough momentum. Kept that inside line out of Long Beach. In a very exciting finish there.